it's me, Rashid. You know what? After I've uh, gotten a few questions uh, lately, I don't know what it is. Um, people want to know what coin, what token, what coin, what token. And I guess because of the Zanit coin and the crypto coin, um, you know, the Shibu and, you know, Doge and, you know, Solana is doing really well. I mean, like amazing. Right. So, so everybody's looking for that next coin. Which one is it? And so people, I don't know, they just decided to ask me. Um, and so just recently, I've had um, more, more than my fair share of people just out of the blue asking me what coin, you know, what's next? What's the next big coin? Um, to I'll be honest with you, the, the, the coins that I'm interested in right now, I'm going to tell you, one is a neat coin. Two, guess what? XYO. That's right, baby. XYO. If you've watched, um, in 2019, XYO became the uh, project, blockchain project that I thought was like really interesting. And it was based out of, uh, out of, uh, out of San Diego. So I was actually at the launch and was able to really understand what they were doing. Uh, they had something called proof of location, uh, which is really cool because, you know, we know proof of work. We know proof of uh, stake. We know uh, these different consensus mechanisms, proof of origin, all these different things. Um, but then they came up with proof of location. And I'm like, wow. And so what, that, you know, so for somebody that's in uh, transportation, they got a background in logistics and things like that, you know, been doing that with the, the military for over, you know, over 30 years. That was very interesting to me because they talked about proof of location and how anybody, you know, just like with Bitcoin, right? You know, if the blockchain with Bitcoin, you have the actual um, the nodes that are distributed around the world. So any computer basically can be a node and that computer is trying to solve a problem in order to get that block reward. So your transaction can go through or be added to that particular block so it could get confirmed and then obviously uh, deliver to wherever it needs to go. Well, proof of location is basically saying we got this crowdsourcing of human beings across the globe that can attach a device to anything. So when you talk about AI, Internet of Things, blockchain, and now we got some new things like machine learning, quantum physics, stuff like that, quantum computing. Uh, there's a lot of new things that, that are added to that. But you have something that um, is on the kind of an outer space in the satellite. Satellites. God, I can't think of the word. So there are satellites that are orbiting the Earth that helps with geolocation or geospatial location. And so when you have a company that's doing proof of location, which is giving you that in transit visibility of anything, anywhere at any time. Well, guess what? When FedEx moves your moves your, your shipment, uh, your order from point A to point B, when UPS does that, when MERS moves your shipment across the waters, you lose actual visibility of it when you have a radio frequency tag, right? So this mandatory to put a radio frequency tag on a particular item that's shipped with the DOD. But guess what? When it gets from the port into the water, nobody can find out where it is. You can't track it anywhere. But when you have this proof of location, they have devices that actually are connected to an actual satellite system. Right. And so but it's all tracked on the blockchain. So XYO created an actual device and a system with nodes, which are people that actually will utilize these devices and put them here, there, everywhere um, in backpacks, on bicycles, uh, at stop signs, wherever you need them. I don't know if you ever saw um, the, the the TV show Person of Interest, exactly how that works, right? Person of Interest or even Arrow, where you can see everything at all the time. And, you, you know, you feel like there's somebody behind a computer that actually is monitoring the whole world, you know, kind of like, you know, the uh, Batman and all that kind of stuff. Right. Somebody is monitoring what's going on everywhere at all times. Well, guess what? Proof of location tells me exactly where something is at all times. So if you want real time in transit visibility of your product, service or anything that's in transit, 
then XYO, which they call XY findables, the company itself, XYO is the actual token. They created something called XYO token, right? For their XYO network, which is so awesome, so amazing. And they actually uh, showed us how that all worked and all of the partners out there uh, that helped this thing to, to move. In 2019, I went to their launch. Well, guess what? <laughs> it's 2021. And I just found out that I had basically had over a million tokens, just so you know. And what well, they did something where if you purchase like 50,000, you got another 150,000. And then they went through a process where you got an airdrop. And and if you went to the event then you could have you could win so many. So over time, my my purchase and all of these different you know benefits added up to over a million actual tokens. But what happened then? Um, they kind of had to figure out, is this a security token? Is this a utility token? Are you going to be offering it this way? Are you going to raise funds? So anyway, basically what happened, um, at the end of the day, I purchased, I think my purchase add up to be about uh, something like 400,000 tokens. So 400,000 tokens. I think I spent about $3,000 on that, but I had all these other benefits. So I had about a million at the beginning, but then after they went through this whole process and they converted them to some kind of utility type status, whereas they wouldn't get in trouble with the SEC, I ended up with about 400,000 tokens. But guess what? Just like every other token, I couldn't remember where I put it. <laughs> and two and a half years later, the token at that time was about 0 0.003. Uh, cent per token. And so here it is, um, you know, two years later, guess what happened? <laughs> They're being listed on Coinbase Pro. Yeah, Coinbase Pro. And they're number 210 on the coin market cap. Um, so, you know, I started looking for my coins, right? My tokens, actually, now they're coins. Um, <laughs> and so I'm looking for so here's the thing, right? The moral of the story is this. Yes, I did find them. And now I'm working with uh, my Ether wallet to go ahead and uh, make sure that my tokens basically uh, are where they're supposed to be. And now the token is worth zero two cent. Yes, it is. So life is going to get a lot better here very soon. So basically what I've done is I purchased a few more, you know, just in case, because like I said, over time, uh, the coins, they do a lot of shifting around. So I may end up with like 50,000 or something like that after all of this is said and done because I went to the website. I saw that they had changed um, the structure. So from the token to the coin, uh, there was like a 10 percent like reduction or something. So, I, you know, I get it. Right. You're never going to get what you initially got. That's how they keep this thing moving. So I'm going to see if I can get whatever it is left. I think I'm going to have about 50,000 of those left. Um, and it's right, like I said, about two cent right now. So I'm cool with that. Just like with my engine coin, you know, I purchased a, <coughs> a lot of those when they were real cheap. And, you know, four years later, they was worth 5000 right about $7,000. And by the time I actually got to them, um, they went up to about um, $2.70 each. So they're worth about 8000 and so now um, I have a lot more of the XYO and I believe XYO, you know, this this particular coin is it is going to really take off because of the listing is one reason. And then two, um, because it does have a usability and they are working hard to uh, really scale that. And, and CRPT, uh, Cryptarium has another one I'm trying to get hold to those. I got about 60,000 of those as well. And so if you want to know what coin um, is hot, which coin is taken off, which one's going to be the next Solana, um, you know, from me to you, I'm no, I'm not perfect at this. I never give out this type of information, but I'm pretty sold on XYO. I am so happy that they are on coin market cap as well as on Coinbase Pro. So if you want to get you some, they're about two cent right now. Like I said, I got them when they was 0 0.003. Now you can get them for two cent. Uh, they just increased about 70 percent uh, in one day and it's uh, it went up and went down. You know how that goes. So I believe that with what they're doing, it's going to it's going to really do some good here in the next year or so. Um, so number one, Zanique coin, because of their launch with the tokenization and they have so many other plans in place to support their coin. Started off at two cent in April. Now it's up to 40 cent. 
and it's been it's about over seven or eight hundred percent increase already in four months. So we know where that's going to go. Um, then we have, like I said, XYO. It hit corn market cap at two ten. Now um, it's on corn uh, Coinbase Pro, so you can get it for about two cent each. Went up seventy percent in one one day, and it's going to shoot through the roof here pretty soon. You have crypto coin as well. Uh, so, you know, if you want to get your crypto coin, then you're going to have to go to Dex Trade or uh, to uh, Hotbit and you can do that. Now, the better choice would be one with the Zelite coin. Go ahead and get with uh, one of the affiliates and get with the program where you can mint your coins right to your uh, back office on a continuous basis for 20 years. Or you can go to um, Crypto Future and get your coins, uh, the crypto coin uh, and you can get some additional benefits as a member of Crypto Future. You can get with me on all of this, or you can just st go straight to Coin, uh, Coinbase Pro and go ahead and purchase some XYO um, uh, with USD, with Euros, with USDT, and you can purchase it with Bitcoin. So that's my story about what coin is going to go to the moon next. Peace. And I'm out. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.